what is up guys welcome back to my channel it is your girl jerusalem steph and i'm back with another video this video i'm honestly going to be doing something a little bit different because i feel like i've never really done this before like i kind of like will get like real like personable with y'all real intimate if you will but i really never really got like this intimate i'm not really the type of person to tell a lot of people my business because i like to keep my business to myself i love privacy i love like not being online and like telling everybody everything is that the wrong with telling people some things about you it's perfectly fine but i love to like just have a certain level of privacy but today i am going to be talking about how everything is a lie and life does not make no difference <laughs> so <laughs> i want to talk about this because i've been talking about this for a for like a while like i've been thinking about this i had a conversation with one of my like friends and we were just talking about this like just talking about a lot of deep stuff and talking about how everything is just a lie like everything that you see everything that that you do all your entire life is a lie um tomorrow I do turn 18 years old and the older I get the more I realize that everything is just a waste of time and I say this because not like in a like negative way like Oh, everything is a waste of time. Don't do nothing with your life because me, I've accomplished a lot of stuff. If you guys watched my last video, you guys saw that I graduated with my two-year degree. So it's not to say never do anything with your life or don't have anything going on because I think that people should have stuff going on all the time. I think that you should be motivated and productive as like a good amount. But when you really sit up and think about the entirety of your life, when you die, what do you really think that people are going to remember about you? So those things that you keep thinking, oh, but that would be so embarrassing if I did this. It would be so embarrassing if I did this. It would be embarrassing if I told that guy I liked him. Oh, it's going to be so embarrassing if I start my YouTube channel. It's going to be embarrassing if I apply for this job and I don't get it. Stop thinking like that. Stop thinking in the negative. You need to shift your mind to the positive because at the end of the day, all of this is going to vanish. It's all going to go away. And you don't want to spend your whole entire existence on this planet we call Earth wasting time just living in fear living in anxiety and as i'm speaking to y'all i'm speaking to myself because this is a life that i have lived for my very long 18 years of life i have been scared i have been fearful i have been living in a state of negativity and really just as i get older you have to come in the positive i was just sitting in bed laying in bed scrolling on my phone and I just, you know, recently did something and I'm, you know, it didn't work out the way. Well, I did two things. <laughs> Neither of them worked out the way that I hoped that they would. And sometimes I will be delusional and say, well, it's going to work out the way that I want it to eventually. But that is not always reality. Sometimes you have to accept what reality is and not try to be delusional. All right, my camera did cut off, y'all. They don't want y'all to get this message. What I was saying is... Basically, what I'm trying to say is all the stuff that you're afraid to do, just go do it. Like, seriously, like, I'm just being honest with you. Just go do it. Like, just go do it right now. Like, like after you finish this video, go do it. Because there's no point of sitting around and thinking, oh, and like, when before you die, you know, whenever that is, if it's at 90, if it's at, you know, sooner than that, younger than that, whatever time, do you really want your last thought to be, oh, shoot, wish I would have did this, wish I would have said this, wish I would have did this. I was talking to my parents yesterday. I was driving. We were going. Where were we going? We came from back from Top Golf. We did like a family day. And we came back from Top Golf. I'm driving. And I was like, I told somebody that I loved them once. A specific person, one of my friends, I told the person that I loved them. And they didn't say it back. And I felt like, like basically like rejected because I'm like, oh, well, they don't love me. I don't know. Now, this person definitely loves me for sure. I know this for a fact. But I'm just saying, like, I feel like, oh, I shouldn't say it now. I've never told them I love them again. That was, like, a whole year ago, actually. <laughs> but you know what? Next time I want to say that I love them, I should just say it. Because there's no point of living life like there's so much time when there isn't. There's no time. There's no time like the present. Like they say, there's no time like the present. We don't have time, y'all. One thing we don't have is time. There's not much time left. Um, on earth there's not much time for our lives there's not much time it's just like don't take life too seriously because it's not much time left like it's just not much and I, what is one quote that I always like think about I always think about this quote I think the quote is don't take life too seriously because 
I'm trying to think. What's going on? Don't take life too seriously because it's not much of it. Or something like that. I just wanted to give y'all that message. Like, whatever you're thinking about doing or, like, whatever, whatever it is that you are, like, huh, oh, I want to do this. I've been thinking about it. Well, it's, like, a starting a business. Obviously, be reasonable. Don't, like, go into debt or, like, go to jail or something. <laughs> Don't. Because, <laughs> you know, some people take that as, like, oh, all right, now go do it in anything. Like, just do whatever. Like, I'm not that type of person. I wouldn't advise nobody to do nothing, like, crazy, like crazy, crazy. But stuff that sometimes people just think everything is crazy. I was just thinking yesterday, I was like, it's funny because everybody thinks stuff is crazy until somebody makes money from it. Like, when YouTube first started, I'm sure pretty plenty of people saw YouTubers and were like, oh, it's so crazy that you're doing YouTube or you're making money. You're just recording videos on a platform and posting it. Like, you're so goofy for doing that. Oh, you're wasting your time, blah, blah, blah. People don't realize people make so much money off of these YouTube channels, bro. That's why I didn't want to, like, at first I thought about starting my channel. And I think I, I started my first channel during the pandemic. And I was just uploading travel vlogs. And then I was like, wait, I want to speak on Black Lives Matter. I started speaking on that. Actually, I'll put that video down in the description box so y'all can watch it. It hit 1K views. That's my biggest video. That's on my old channel. And then I was like, wait, I should make a new channel. So I made a new channel, which is this channel. And then I was like, you know what? I should just upload vlogs and just like random stuff in my life. And it's like, all right, like people like actually watch my channel, which is so crazy. I don't know who be watching it. Like, I really don't. Like, I know my parents watch it. But besides that, I don't really know anybody who watches it. But <laughs> I'm sure somebody is going to watch this video right now. Like, people actually watch it, which is crazy. But, you know, life is just it's so short and we just shouldn't waste time thinking about how things could go wrong. If it goes wrong great failure is a part of life failure is failure failure isn't even failure failure is just a different path you take a different path it's like a chart and a lot of times people think like success is like success is like you just fail one time and then all the time all you just randomly succeed no success is like fail 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 like, I know y'all seen that chart, the one that says where you fail, 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 and then you succeed. But that's literally the way life is. You have to fail so many times. I can't give you, I can't tell you how many times I failed at something, did horribly, did a bad job. I just applied for some jobs recently. They may tell me no. Like, you're not getting, you're not, we're not going. Like, <laughs> we're not going for it. But that's okay. No matter how many people, so many people that I've liked that didn't like me back. Or so many situations where I wanted to do this and it didn't work out. It's so much stuff that I've tried to do that didn't work out. Even this YouTube channel, I like I low-key feel like a failure. <laughs> Cause I've been doing this channel for a year and I don't really have that many subscribers, supporters. So I kind of feel like a failure. You know, I feel I see all these other people on this app and they have thousands and hundreds and millions of you know, supporters and people in the comment section and people just talking about them in everyday life and reposting their content and just like subscribing to them and and they just have so many followers and they make so much of money and live in these huge houses. But also part of life is realizing that rejection is part of protection because everything is not for you. Unfortunately, I think like in the society, we just think that everything we want should just like, we should just get it. But, and I'm telling you this because just because you try to do something doesn't mean it's guaranteed to, you're guaranteed to get it. I'm telling you to try. I'm not telling you you're guaranteed to get it because a lot of people nowadays with like manifestation and like feminine energy and masculine energy, alpha male, beta male, this, that. Oh, I'm so sick of hearing all about, all about all of that. And all of that has their place. I'm not saying that all of that is false and all that type of stuff, but I'm saying like, I'm just tired of hearing about it personally. But anyways, that's not the point. <laughs> the point is everything is not for you every single thing every person that you want or every job that you want sometimes re rejection is protection so you're getting protected from this person you're getting protected from this job this experience this location you're getting protected so don't always look at rejection or like not getting what you want as a negative so in conclusion rejection is protection if you want something go try it out Failure is not the end of your life. <laughs> Failure is just a part of life. Failure is just the path to success. And success is not the end goal. You have to continue to succeed and continue to make something of your life.
and I hope you guys enjoyed this video because I, <laughs> I enjoy making it honestly I honestly prefer like more sit down videos but I don't know people just I guess like vlogs more but yeah I love you guys tons